Hello everyone and welcome back to James's Classic Movies. Today we've got a double feature for you. Uh, Bruce Almighty followed by Evan Almighty. I'm going to talk about these two films today. Filmed in 2003, uh, Bruce Almighty stars Jim Carrey as Bruce Nolan, a reporter. Uh, Morgan Freeman as God. Jennifer as Aniston as Grace, uh, Bruce's girlfriend. Steve Carell as Evan Baxter, Lisa Ann Walter as uh, Grace's sister, Debbie, and of course, uh, our beauty queen, Catherine Bell as Susan Ortega. This picture was nominated for a Kids' Choice Award. Our story is about a man uh, who's a failure at life, a failure at his job, and soon to be a failure in his relationship. Uh, so he turns around and blames God for everything, all his shortcomings and so forth. But God finally has enough of this and says, come here. <laughs> and endows him with godly powers. And away we go with our story. Take a look at this. Good dream. Have you ever felt... I'm Bruce Nolan for Eyewitness News. Hey, wacky Bruce. Unappreciated. In the newsroom, we don't wear hairnets. <laughs> God. Why do you hate me? Have you ever thought life... What are you doing over there? ...was unfair? Run! Have you ever complained about it? So God is picking on you? What is that? The only one around here not doing his job is you! You must be Bruce. Who are you? I am God. <laughs> Please. Okay, how many fingers am I holding up? Seven. Aha! <laughs> You've been doing a lot of complaining about me, Bruce. You think you can do it better, so here's your chance. When you leave this building, you will be endowed with all my powers. It's funny, I woke up this morning and I swear my boobs felt bigger. Do they look bigger to you? Bigger. Having fun? From the director of Liar Liar. You took the job, Bruce. I suggest you get to it. You've got prayers. Comes the story of supreme power. I've never seen the moon that big. We really shouldn't waste it. Divine intervention. Sam. And proof. I'm Evan Baxter, and here's what's making news. That heaven <laughs> has a wicked sense of humor. <laughs> that looks like my new co-anchor may need a glass of water. <laughs> Jim Carrey. I will send You had my powers for a little over a week. How many people have you helped? <gasps> but I guess you can't now. Being dead and all. I'm dead? Nah, I'm just messing with you. Bruce Almighty. <laughs> this movie was a huge success at the box office, grossing $484.6 million on an $81 million budget. That's not bad for uh, this kind of comedy a movie. But then it generated a sequel some four years later in 2007. Uh, that sequel is Evan Almighty. This time, uh, Evan Baxter would uh, jump in the, the seat with godly powers. Well, not as much as godly powers, but, you know, <laughs> God had a few twists for him. Uh, like I said, filmed in 2007, starring Steve Carell, reprising his role as Evan Baxter, and Lauren Graham as his wife, Joan, uh, Johnny Simmons as his one of his sons, Dylan, and Morgan Freeman, of course, is God, and Jim Carrey's in this with Wanda Sykes. Uh, our Evan now, he no longer a news anchor and, and is a U.S. congressman. Well, God has other plans for him. He wants him to build an ark. <laughs> That's it, an ark. And uh, to, me, to me, it was a great picture. I, I enjoyed both of them immensely. And before I tell you what happened, uh, I want you to take a look at this clip. Keep an open mind now. 
I am successful, powerful, handsome, happy. Newly elected Congressman Evan Baxter's life. What are we gonna do? He's That's right! Was going exactly as planned. There he is, the big kahuna. I think I have to do the dance. Do the dance. Mm, 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 mm. Until he met someone. Oh! Oh! With a plan of his own. Who are you? I'm God. Flood's coming, and I want you, Evan Baxter, to build an ark. Uh, yeah. Hey, Dad, look, two doves. Well, today must be my lucky day. Now, no matter where he turns... Those animals are following me. See, if you had an ark, you'd have a place to put them all. No matter what he does. Wow, what's with the scruffle, mountain man? Whenever I shave, the beard grows right back in. Steven, <gasps> what happened? Did you fall in a mine shaft? Did you just come out of a coma? No. Were you attacked by a werewolf? There's just no escaping. Obviously, the stresses of this office have proven too much for you. His destiny. I lost my job, everything. Why are you doing this? Why me? You want to change the world, son. So do I. Here we go. Gentlemen, I have come up with a little construction project for us this weekend. Oh! The whole weekend? Ow! Yes. Maybe a couple weekends after that. You're talking about building a boat. It might be something fun for the family. It'd be great in case it floods or something. From the director of Bruce Almighty. Go! Go! Comes the next chapter in the almighty story of them all. I know that this doesn't make any sense. I just want you to trust me. Dad, I'm with you. Me too. Is that a llama with a hammer? Let's finish this sucker. Are you ready for this summer... His name is Evan Baxter, but now he goes by New York's Noah. Heaven's Evan, the weirdo with a beardo. When it comes to saving the world... What's up? Some assembly may be required. Let's go! Oh. Thanks. I can't even get my cat to use the little box. People! The flood is imminent! Is it too much to ask for a little precipitation? Evan Almighty. Everybody, hang on! Uh, the sequel from the 2007 uh, was filmed on a $175 million budget. In the U.S. alone, it made $100 million, and in Europe, it made $72 million. After all the changes counted up and everything in the box, it turned 174 million, losing a million, uh, not even making uh, its uh, filming budget back. Uh, fa a failure at the box office. Uh, the moral of the story is uh, <laughs> don't put all your eggs in one basket. If you're going to make a sequel, don't get carried away <laughs> unless you know it's going to be a success. Uh, I guess. Uh, they got uh, they got inspired by the the high returns on the uh, uh, Bruce Almighty picture and uh, figured it could do just as good. Well, I can understand where it coming from. It was a good picture, and uh, I hope that you'll add both of these to your collection and enjoy them because they are well made, I believe. And I well I I enjoy a good movie. And I'm sure that you do too. And uh, like I said in previous uh, reviews, no, we can find the bad to say about anything. We can find the bad in anything. But it's hard to find the good and uh, look for the good and stuff. But I'm telling you, these movies are good. Even though kind of a little over the top. But, you know, still funny anyway. Until next time, I'm James with James's Classic Movies. You have been watching Bruce Almighty and Evan Almighty. See you next time.